wholesale sellout to Exxon Mobil. Guyana's oil business with Exxon has become a cancer, a deadly poison to the leaders of this land in all camps. Since the up new AFC signed that horrible Exxon contract and left office, little or nothing we hear from them. And when you do hear, they selectively choose what they want to respond to when Kaicho News and other media houses exposes what's going on in the oil sector. As for the government, ever since ex-president Jagdeo put himself in charge of the oil sector, all you hear from him is about the 14 new oil blocks to come on stream. What? and what Guyana will get out of them if, yes, if oil is found in them. And keep on promising that the mistakes the coalition made with Exxon Stabrook Black contract will not be repeated in those 14 new oil contracts. This has been Jack Deere's mantra every time he opens his mouth to talk about oil. Why is he only correcting and fixing everything for the future oil blocks and not correcting the golden goose we have presently in Exxon Stabrook oil field called the Stabrook block, which has 600 oil blocks inside, not 14, but 600 that holds almost 90% of Guyana's oil in it. Let me give you an idea so you get an understanding. This is the Stabrook block from Suriname to Venezuela with 600 oil block in here. He's not focusing on this. He's focusing on 14 tiny oil blocks outside the Stabrook block. Can somebody tell me something? Say something? They are so barefaced and shameless what's going on. That they don't want to come out in person and tell us how much we collect from the oil. January to March, the first quarter of 2023. Vice President Jack Dale get Bank of Guyana today to put out a statement to the press saying Guyana received 219 million in royalty and profits. Three months. 90 days, Guyana get 219 million. And Exxon made 6.3 million US every hour throughout 2022 in profits. Prepare your minds to suffer just like how our brothers and sisters in Africa and Asia barely eating one meal a day. What's happening here presently? with your resources, is what took place there. Are you really, really prepared to be silent on this? Or are you settling for 5,000 to wear a green jersey and a 10,000 to wear a red jersey and clap, clap your hands to vote for them? Which one? More to come on this. Please share and join me on every TikTok.